Hey guys, we're going to talk about the Kubi Vagrant. This is a nice little OS 10. Yeah, you heard me, OS 10. Um, knife, EDC style knife from Kubi. And we're going to do a review on it. So let's take a look first at, zoom out of here, at the numbers. So closed, this is about four and a half inches. Blade length on this. It's going to be, we're talking about three and a half inches, overall length, just a little over seven. All right. I feel like Matthew McConaughey there. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> all right, the jokes are getting bad, guys. Christmas is coming. I'm tired. Uh, weight here is 3.4. All right, so... If you saw the previous video on the Nova, very similar knife, Orange G10. This is, as I said, an OS 10 steel blade. Very, very similar pocket clip. Uh, you can flip it, but not end to end. You're talking tip up carry. Mm, pretty nicely centered blade. Nice aggressive jimping on there. Kind of that oblong thumb hole, which to me, is not the most ergonomic. Uh, your hands are probably going to be different than mine, but uh, the ceramic ball bearings in there. But yeah, I have a little trouble opening it. This one has a really strong detent. I really love this almost sheep's foot blade, really, with a nice little upswept tip. It's a really nice. I just, you know, like I said, just the way this kind of, I can get it left handed, but I have a little trouble getting it right handed. Uh, I am a lefty though. So really cool little knife for the money. Really nice pocket clips. Um, not as thick as the Nova. It is definitely a little thinner gauge. But overall, really a nice little knife. I really like using this one. And um, just like the other one, the OS 10, you know, takes a really nice fine edge. It, um, let me, you know, it, it will most definitely get sharving. Sharving. <laughs> shaving sharp really really quickly so all right so once again we're back to why kubi uh, as i mentioned in the previous video some people like to accessorize they like the options and colors uh this knife here is about 40 bucks this is a really nice addition to a collection out of budget uh you know unfortunately knife prices have gone up so and but you know if you like the design the steel OS 10, you know, nobody was complaining about OS 10 when Spyderco was using it. I'm not going to complain about it. It's a good um, stainless steel uh, on par, just, you know, a hair below VG 10. So, I mean, you really can't complain. Overall, this is a really nice, decent knife for the money. You know, well built, good bearings in there. You know, like I said, my only complaint, it's a little tough for me to flip, you know, but it goes, just not ideal for me your hands you know your mileage may vary but cool little knife for 40 bucks i definitely i like carrying you know here's the thing is i have the uh the vagrant and the nova you know and it's like this one i like the blade shape and i like the size it carries this one just deploys so much nicer and it's so much smoother so it's like i wish i could just find a goldilocks between the two of them but really cool little knives i definitely like the kubi i would definitely um buy more there's nothing i see about this their qualities up there with the other comparable brand names if you buy a uh chinese made spider go this is you know essentially the same quality so overall not bad at all i'm really enjoying kubi and i will definitely go back to them for more knives